Tonight, I want to speak about how we move forward. Hey guys, how are you? Create a business, grow jobs. From the Voice of America studios in Washington, D.C. A cricket ball? But I'm doing a U.S. election show, not a cricket Thank show. Thank you. Actually, U.S. elections are not much different than a cricket match. Like cricket, U.S. elections happen between two major teams, Democrats and Republicans. In one day cricket, you have to perform good in 50 overs. And here in U.S. elections, you have to perform good in 50 states. Instead of having more runs, you must have more votes to win. So let's play elections. Let's start with the latest and biggest news. Big night for Mitt Romney. This Tuesday, Republican candidate Mitt Romney won the primary in Florida State. People all over Florida, thank you tonight for this great victory. So what are primaries? And with whom is Mr. Romney fighting with? It's like choosing captain in one team. The difference is that, unlike cricket boards choosing captain in cricket, party members choose the captain or their presidential nominee in these primaries. Democratic team already has a captain or their presidential nominee as president, president of the United States, Barack Obama. The other team, Republican Party, has to choose a captain or their presidential nominee who will finally play or fight against Democratic nominee, President Barack Obama. So these primaries are the selection process in which voters of the Republican Party vote to choose their nominee for President of the United States in the 2012 presidential election. In every state, the winner automatically wins some delegates. Whoever wins the most delegates will be the Republican nominee for the presidential election. Till then, we have to see the scores in every state. Keep watching to know who wins White House. Till then, bye-bye.